Hey there, it's Amelia, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a recurring meeting in Zoom and also how to edit the descriptions for each occurrence in the recurring meetings. First, I'll show you one that I've already set up. This is a test meeting, and there's three occurrences on three different dates. Now, the topic name is the same. However, if I click on this occurrence, you'll see that the description is topic one. I'll return back to meetings. And if I click on the second occurrence, you'll see that the description is topic two. And finally, for the third occurrence, the description is topic three. So to set up a recurring meeting, click schedule a meeting and you'll put the title of your meeting. So I'm gonna leave the description blank for now and then I'll show you how to edit the description for each occurrence. So it will default to today's date. You can change the time and the duration if needed, as well as the time zone. So you wanna select recurring meeting and then select the recurrence. So for example, if you wanted a monthly meeting to repeat every month on a particular day, and then you want to put in that it's going to end on a particular day. I'm just going to set this for say three months. So right now it's March, April, May, June. I'll just end it in July. Or you can set up a number of occurrences. I'll leave everything else as is and click save. Now, if you're already inside the meeting, and this happens to be the first occurrence, click edit and you'll be prompted to edit either this occurrence or all occurrences. So I wanna edit this occurrence. Okay, and next I wanna click add description and notice it will not let me change the topic information. So I'll click add description and let's say this is the monthly meeting for March. I'll just gonna put in March budget meeting. And I'll copy that so I can paste it for the next occurrence and just change the month. And I'll leave everything else as is and click save. Now you can get to the other occurrences to edit a couple ways. You can click show all occurrences and access the occurrences this way. Or if you're on the home page on meetings, you can get to the different occurrences here. So for instance, for new test meeting, I would scroll down and if I wanted to change to April. So it depends how you're going in. Let's say I wanna change the April meeting description. So I'll go ahead and click on this meeting. There's also an edit here as well. While in this particular occurrence, I'll click edit, edit this occurrence, select description, paste in, the previous description and change that to April and click save. Now while I'm in there, I'll also change the May meeting description. I'll click show all occurrences. I'll click on May 6th. I'll click on edit, edit this occurrence. Click add description, change that to May, and click save. Now also from the home page, if I click meetings, you can't see the descriptions from this particular page, but if you click further in, you could see the description for that occurrence. And that's all there is to setting up a recurring meeting and also editing the descriptions for each occurrence in a recurring meeting. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and smash the like button and remember to subscribe so you don't miss any new videos. I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.